Welcome to the Brass Check TV list, and I'd like to let you in on what to expect. We mail twice a day, once in the morning, and by morning I say morning East Coast time, and once in the evening we do a rebroadcast in the evening. Um, don't feel you have to look at every video, and if you see something that you're not interested, just delete, no problem. But do stay on the list. We are a better than average news source, and what's our purpose uh, for being here? Uh, well, our purpose for being here is two, twofold. One is to give the other side of the story. And uh, you can count on the corporate news to give you the corporate side of every story. And it's a little bit like a, um, a puppet show. Uh, on the one hand, you have supposedly left-leaning uh, news outlets. Uh, and then on the other hand, you have supposedly right-leaning news outlets. But at the end of the day, they're both serving the same master. In the old days, that master used to be called big money interests. And I think we really should go back to that definition because it's very straightforward. Uh, whoever has the most money and the most uh, w uh, willingness to deploy it aggressively in, in meeting their goals, uh, those are the people that control the news media. And so we're an alternative to that. And I like to say that, you know, in a lot of areas of life, we don't get what we deserve. You know, we don't have the government we deserve. We don't have the politicians we deserve, or at least I hope we don't, we, I hope we don't deserve these clowns. Uh, we don't have the medical system we deserve. We don't have the educational system we deserve. But you know what? We do have the media system we deserve because we are all able to turn off Fox and turn off CNN and turn off MSNBC and seek out things that are closer to the truth. And having found those sources, we're able to support them financially. People spend money on newspapers. They spend money on their cable bill every month. If you want good media, there's a simple solution. Support it. So this is a not-so-subtle pitch to say, if you like what we're doing, consider supporting us financially. But understand our mission. So our mission is to present the other side of the story, the non-big money interests. And big money interests control everything. They are the reason that we are now currently in endless war. All right? We are obviously not under attack by anybody, and yet we're spending more money and have more people working on military issues practically than World War II. And we're fighting a bunch of dirt poor people who basically have slingshots and uh, you know, not much more than slingshots and arrows to fight back. Uh, and it's never, it's, until we stop it, it's never going to end, and it's only going to accelerate. So that's the war front. And by the way, CNN, MSNBC, Fox, they never saw a war they didn't like. That includes NPR. So we are anti-war. I'm going to be upfront about it. I'm not shy about saying it. Uh, there better be a really, really, really good reason to go to war. And I haven't seen one in a long, 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 long time. And we know that most wars are generated by fraud. But we'll stop there because I could talk all day about that. Uh, the other area that we pay a lot of attention to uh, is, is corporate corruption. Uh, on the one hand, in the financial markets, uh, it's out of control. Uh, uh, many big banks are really hardly anything more than uh, laundromats for, for drug dealing and other uh, major crimes. Uh, and that's just a fact. And they're fined constantly, and they constantly get away with it. So that's our financial system. Uh, and then we have the issue of pollution, uh, for lack of a better word. And we tend to focus on the health impacts of, of pollution. Uh, a lot of people are wringing their hands, worrying about the future of the planet. Well, I can tell you the planet's in no danger at all. The planet's not going anywhere. Uh, however, we are in danger. And when I say we, I mean right individually, you and me, and our children and grandchildren, and our friends and neighbors, and our extended families. Uh, so we cover quite a bit of material on how to protect yourself from the countless number of corporate manufactured food and uh, other products that are actually very dangerous. Um, and that includes pharmaceutical products. And we talk a lot about corruption in medicine, which is also completely out of control. So we do that. The other thing we do is we provide a historical memory so that when there is a anniversary of something important uh, that the news media is neglecting, uh, and it's amazing how they neglect uh, the anniversary now of the assassination of John F. Kennedy um, or Robert F. Kennedy or Martin Luther King, uh, or they softball it. Uh, we make sure on those days 
uh, that we come out with some really detailed hardening information about those cases. Uh, but we also cover a lot of uh, historical events that may not be as epic, but are as equally important because that is the one thing that is missing from all media, even some of the really good progressive media, which is a historical memory. So in addition to providing background uh, and in-depth information and an alternative point of view on the stories of the day, we are constantly reminding our readers and, and viewers of things that have occurred in the past and how they formed where we are today. So that's Brass Check. Uh, again, we mail twice a day. Uh, the second thing is, you know, sometimes I miss mails that I get in the morning, so it's nice to be reminded in the afternoon or the evening. Um, the, the videos can be short. Sometimes they're just a couple of minutes. Sometimes they're longer. Uh, it's up to you, obviously, on, on how much you want to invest in this, but you will be a much better informed person. Uh, financial support, I'll be frank, but we, you know, we need it. Uh, we have a monthly server bill. We have a monthly email management software bill. We have a tech guy that keeps everything running. He's got to be paid, uh, and he does get paid. Uh, and I like to make a little money every now and then, too, from all the work I do. So that's not the, uh, the point here. I do make my living from other things. Uh, and, I, and, you know, we're over 20 years old here at, at uh, Brass Check. We've been at this since 1997. And uh, for the first, see, almost 10 years, uh, never occurred to me to, to try to even pay the bills with support or help. But, you know, we're at a point now where, you know, we could use, we could use the assistance. So you're not only getting, um, a, I think, a good news source that you're not going to get from other sources, um, good information, uh, but you're also helping make sure that this information is preserved and broadcast and put out in the world. So that's Brass Check TV. Thank you very much for subscribing. And please tell everybody uh, you know that there is an alternative to the corporate controlled news media. And Brass Check, I'm, just, I'm not going to be uh, falsely modest here. We're a small thing, but day by day, month in, month out, year in, year out, we've been one of the best, most reliable sources of news anywhere. And uh, we intend to continue that for the next 20 plus years to come. Thank you.